Hi, hi, hi. You're from uh, Cape Town. I'm in heaven and I'm going to give you some amazing data. So, you know, people go to the gym in order to grow the muscle and do diet in order to lose weight and communicate in their relationships in order to improve their relationship and work on the business in order to get money. And they think that the reason that something happened is the actions that they do, that they push weight, that they don't eat that they communicate and while it bring results and it's true the actual reason the actual why behind why pushing weight works or not work and how fast it will grow and what will actually improve anything in life has to do with something fascinating and that's what I'm going to explain to you today. Let's have a look. If you look at your life, everything around you makes you an effect. You look at the wall and you're the effect of the wall. You need to eat, you're the effect of the body. You need to sleep, you want to take something, you need to walk in order to get it. 99.9% .9 of your time, you are the effect of the environment. And yet, only when you are cause will you be successful. So you will see that actually the reason you don't use all your potential, it is because most of the time you are the effect of the environment. And what you need to do is to become cause of the environment. So how do you become cause of the wall? How do you become cause of anything? Well, in the gym, it's quite easy. You go and you push weight and you improve. But even at the gym, you will improve only to the degree that you will consider that you're causing the motion. People call it in the gym, mind muscle connection. When you do, for example, a diet, you will be successful only to the degree that you causing it and it, you are not the effect. When you're the effect, it's difficult. You don't like it, you craving food and overall you don't lose weight. Even if you do lose weight, it's for temporary time. Same thing with relationship. For as long as you don't cause it, even if there, is re there are results that are temporary and you will lose them and the end result will be worse than when you started. And the why is because you need to put it there to cause it and not let it happen to you. Now, how do you cause things? How do you become cause of a wall? How do you become cause of the gym? How do you become cause of those things that you consider that you don't like? Well, the secret is that it is a number game. At any given second, you are bombarded by endless amount of particles that making you effect and you need to flow out particles to make yourself cause. And the magic is that it's not important what you flow out. As long as you flow out and a lot, you will become more and more and and more and more cause and all of a sudden you will see that you can cause anything you want and any effect that will happen to you will be causative effect you will want to be that effect now how do you do that how do you basically change the flow of this universe how do you change this matrix that actually make you an effect all the time and how do you become all of a sudden you well that's going to be the subject of my next seminar which is from zero to hero now. I'm not going to give you the dates yet. I'm not going to give you a link to register yet. I'm telling you it's coming. Get ready. Follow me and I will tell you when it's going to happen and you will join it and I promise you and you know that you have money back guarantee with me. I promise you that you will use your full potential by the end of this seminar. What do I mean? You will flow out, you will put things there and not be the effect of things around you. You will locate yourself and not be located by things around you. You will be you. Thank you. Bye-bye.